Guys, so I'm literally having issues downloading my video onto YouTube. So I had to download another app. And apparently, in order to use that app, you have to purchase it. Now, the purchase price is about $70 for a one-time fee for the whole entire year if you want to use it without the watermark. Now, what a watermark is, if you guys don't know, is something that... It's what they put on a picture or a video that you are using and that you can clearly see their name on there. So, because the app that I always use on my computer is called a Video Editor. And that's the only thing that can actually read the camera that I'm currently using right now. Oh, guys, I swear, like, I don't have not $1 to spend on getting any apps right now to this computer like i swear when i had my mac computer it never gave me this problem i never had to purchase anything to edit my videos and that was when i didn't do youtube at the time but this is really making me think about literally buying a mac computer like hopefully pray to god that I can find a my computer that's used and that's cheap. So, guys, pray to me. Because right now, I'm the only thing I can do right now is use this app. And it's going to have a watermark on it. So, guys, if you really do enjoy my videos and you watch the whole thing with a watermark on it, I'm so, 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 so sorry, guys. Like, I'm trying my best. Like... I really need to upload my videos every Sunday and Wednesday. That's my New Year's resolution. So. Hey everyone, I miss you guys so very much. I hope you guys had a very good, happy New Year's. All I did was just stay in the house and currently right now I am filming this video and then also a TikTok video. So I am going to try my best to make these two videos the perfect and most fabulous as I can. So if you haven't already, guys, please follow me on TikTok. It's also the same name as my YouTube channel, color me underscore sunny and that is with an I. So let's get on with this look. So today I'm only going to use two, actually maybe three eyeshadows. So the first one I'm going to go in with this is right over here. This is the Juvia's eyeshadow palette. And this one is the Masquerade Mini by Juvia's. And so I'm going to go in with the light brown shade as um, my trans transition color and then also i'm going to go in with like a darker brown color to deepen my look up a little bit more better and then last but not least i am going to put that pop of color in the middle of my eyelids so let's get on with this look i'm going to go in with a nice fluffy brush and i'm just going to take a nice light brown eyeshadow called burkina inside of the juvia's place eyeshadow palette and then i'm just going to place that all over my eyelids and a little bit above my crease. By the way guys, if you hear any like walking noises or any like horns honking outside, I swear I have the most terrible, kind of a good place to do my video because I do my video right next to the window and then I also have the parking lot right next to my window so literally there's like people always jamming very loud to their music and then it just gets so annoying to the point where literally their music is so loud to the point where the windows are shaking and it kind of disturbs me while I'm doing my video for you guys and then also I have like upstairs neighbors who stomp very very loud so Bear with me guys. I know you're gonna hear a lot of creakings and then also sometimes Evie's in the background playing with the toys, but she is sleeping right now. So that's a plus for me right there. Okay, and the next color I'm gonna go in with is a deeper, darker brown color. And that is in the color Fulani. I think that's how you call it, Fulani. 
but I'm just going to put that in my crease and a little bit above my crease to deepen it out just a little bit more better to give that illusion that I have a bigger eyelid, you know, Asian problems. And just with the same eyeshadow brush that I used earlier for the light brown, I just want to go ahead and just make the lines more smoother. Just to take away those harsh lines. Okay, so now the next color I'm going in with is Giza. It's a nice champagne color and I just want to highlight my brow bone. Okay, so now it's time to do that cut crease. I love doing cut crease, guys. So all you gotta do is just put that on your eyelid. And guys, you know what to do. All you gotta do is look up, down, side to side to make that cut crease. Oof. I love my Anastasia eye primer to make my cut crease. It is super beautiful. It's a light color, so that way I could put on a nice bright eyeshadow on top of it. It works. Guys, I can't believe today is Sunday. It does not feel like it. Like this morning, I went to go outside, and then as like I saw so many cars parked in the parking lot, I'm like, why is everybody home? Doesn't everybody need to be at work right now? And I come to realize it's Sunday, so everybody's just staying home, chilling, relaxing. Yet, of course, because, you know, the holiday and New Year's, everybody was out having fun and drinking. And, you know, I was just home, chilling, watching Netflix. Oh, guys. Oh, my God. And I caught up on Stranger Things. Oh, God. I, I did not know Stranger Things was that good. Okay, so I'm going to go in with a nice flat brush, and I'm just going to put Rory or actually Bori, sorry, which is a nice shimmery neon bright pink eyeshadow onto my lids where I did my cut crease. And I'm just gonna stamp it on there. And of course, I want this eyeshadow to pop even more. So I'm going to put some loose glitter on top of it shadow the pink eyeshadow that I put on my lids now I'm gonna go in with my eyeliner my mascara my falsies and the lipstick that I'm going to use is this one right over here is in the color serene and this one right here is by color red rain this is something that I got from the mystery bundle package from Twee a while ago and this is what it looks like it's like a nice beautiful kind of like a dark nude color and I'm just gonna top that off with some Too Faced lip injection to give it that shine because my lips do feel kind of dry especially with the winter that's the crazy kind of weather has been going on here in florida so let me put that on and then the final look oh my gosh guys i love this you got that pop of champagne color in my inner corner of my eyes and on my eyebrow and you got that beautiful bright pink eyeshadow in like in my, in my eyes you guys do you see do you see and of course i use the dollar tree lashes only a dollar and it's the wispy spiky that's what it's called with with that wispy spiky oh my gosh <laughs> guys say that like five times this is like a, it's like a tongue twister like guys i love that and then especially i love my hair like this right here is literally like three days worth of waves in my hair all i did was just french did one french braid down my head and then this is what it came out to be literally i had it in a french braid for just three whole days and i literally just let it out and this thing is like super wavy but especially it won't stay this long like this pretty and beachy wavy but sometimes i like to use like beach sprays in my hair to even give it that more voluminous wavy look and to give a quick talk guys oh my god it is 2021 oh my gosh like 
2020 went by, I would say not fast, but it went by okay. It's, it, it goes by slower than it usually does. So what my plan for this year is that I really want to do more traveling, especially guys that I am 28 years old. I didn't really travel much. Um, I travel a lot in Florida because of course I live in Florida and I love to go everywhere in Florida, but I want to travel other states. I want to go to like Texas. Um, I want to go to like Colorado where I was born. And I also want to go to California. Just experience like everything guys. Because where I live in Florida, it's not really that much of a big deal. It's just, it's kind of a bit boring. It's not really diverse. So I want to go to a place that's more diverse. Like if I was planning to move somewhere i would move to orlando if that would be my next destination because orlando is like the spot to have fun it's more diverse um it's a lot of shopping places that i would love to go shopping like every single weekend and over here is just where i am it's i just feel like i'm not getting good fresh of air like i want a good fresh of air to breathe and I just that's my plan for this year is to do a lot of traveling to get more content for you guys to do a lot more better vlog for you guys and also I need to do more better at editing my videos now I've seen that a lot of people are using like Mac computers or you know those kind of Mac softwares but I don't have one and I have Windows which I am grateful and appreciative that I do have something that I can edit my videos because I remember a long time ago I wasn't able to afford nothing at all so guys if you stayed this far in this video you guys are just the perfect perfect subscribers fans i love you guys so much so guys i am posting up videos every sundays and wednesdays so please stay tuned to my next video which is this um wednesday that's coming up so i love you guys and have a wonderful beautiful 2021 new year guys let's make this year our year to shine get money be wealthy and spend more time with our families as much as possible. Bye guys. Mwah.